say one thing. I would certainly say, having never worked at this Cleveland Playhouse and having heard great, great things from friends of mine that have worked here, and also because I went to Ryder College, which is 10 minutes down the road from Princeton, so McCarter is also a place from my youngest days that I always wanted to work and never have. So those, those things were, were important to me. But as far as the play is concerned, I've made kind of a career out of playing large, loud, blustery, obnoxious people, uh, larger than life kinds of characters. And this guy is kind of tailor-made for that. And when I, um, when I read it and, and auditioned for it, I just, had, I just had a feeling that I was made for it. That, you know, you don't always have that feeling. Um, certain parts come along and you go, oh, this is going to be a stretch or this is going to be a reach and oh my God, I wonder if, you know, not this. This I, I just felt in my bones the minute I read it. I said, yeah, I'm, I'm the guy for this. And God, I hope, I hope that they agree because I really think I could bring some, you know, some good stuff to it. And thankfully, you know, it doesn't always work out. You know, you audition for things, you hit it out of the park, you think you're brilliant, you don't even get a call back. And then other things, you go in and you think you probably just w were awful and no one would ever hire me ever again as long as I live and you get the job. So, <laughs> you know, there's no rhyme or reason to it. You can't really um, predict. So I was really grateful when, when I got the call to, to do it. And um, I'm having such a good time. It's a really good experience. So Great. Thank you. Great.